Well, I'm nice and tired now. It's quite late. It's just after midnight. And I'm just going to crawl into bed for a nice long snooze. So I will see you in the morning. I had a good sleep, but it was colder than I anticipated. And it, uh, it snowed not a ton, but enough that my loosely tied tarp sank down and I woke up in the night to it being pretty much on top of me. So I just knocked some of the snow off. Just gonna try to get my boots on here. They're uh, usually pretty difficult to get on when they're really cold. And we'll make a fire. Get some coffee going. I got a little fire starter that I made at home. It's just a thin piece of cedar that you soak overnight in lamp oil and then you uh, coat it in wax. That should keep the lamp oil from whoa, dissolving out of it. Absolutely no wind right now, which is great. This fire starter has been sitting in my shed for at least three or four years, so let's see if it actually gets the job done. That's going nicely. I've got a Big thermos uh, that I filled up with hot water just before I left. Snow um, is such a good insulator that when you try to melt it for water, it actually takes quite a while. And it can kind of taste funny. Uh, if you add a little bit of water to your vessel, it should help the snow melt a little bit faster. I do want to ration my water as much as possible. I drank quite a bit last night after getting to camp. So I'll just put a little bit in my pot and hopefully that'll help melt the snow a little bit faster. It's a beautiful day so far.
it'll be dark at around 4, 4.30 today. And I'll want to have a good fire tonight. So got a good uh, dead tree standing right here. I'll buck up and uh, try to get as much wood ready for tonight so that I can stay up later. Otherwise, you crawl into your sleeping bag at around 7 or 8, and it's just uh, pretty uncomfortable to be in a, a sleeping bag that long. not the best wood it's a little punky but it should be all right on second thought not really I'll have to find a better one Oh, it's warming up quite a bit. <sighs> Make for a slushy campsite soon. Got a new Jack Reacher. Just gonna chill for a bit. It doesn't get much better than this.
wood pile is looking decent. I've still got a, two more sections of about four foot and I'll save those for tonight just in case I'm starting to get cold. I'll warm up by bucking those ones up. And I'm just gonna go for a little bit of an explore. You know, this is a lake. Um, it has frozen over, it's probably mushy ice. I won't be going anywhere near the ice, but I'd like to see, you know, what the topography is like just down there. So we'll take a gander. Not too much daylight left. Just had another chill in the hammock, did some more reading. I'm gonna take a lie down just for a little bit, listen to a short story, warm up a bit in the sleeping bag, and then once it gets dark, I'll come out, get the fire going, and make some dinner and try my best to stay up as late as possible so I have a good sleep. Well, I was in my uh, sleeping bag for about 45 minutes. Sun's just about to go down and the temperature has dropped a lot. Uh, hope I can get a really good fire going. The funny thing about e even if you do get a good fire going in the winter and you're nice and close, you know, let's say you're warming your hands by the fire, your back is going to be cold. So we'll see how long I can stay up. Uh, that sleeping bag is pretty comfy. Uh, it'll be definitely good to get some food in my stomach before bed though to keep me warm. So let's see if we can get a nice fire going here uh, on the double and get some of this uh, wood that I chopped up hopefully into a nice blaze. months older than myself. And your mother is alive. Oh, yes, Hardy, the foreman. But when Mr. Windebank came, he made her sell the business. I met him first at the gas fitter's ball, she said. Please? That was a great day. Really nice and relaxing. I'm a little uh, concerned for tomorrow. So much of the snow on the ground has melted, at least here in the forest. And I've got to pull my sled out, so hopefully on the uh, road out it's not so bad, but just going to let the fire die down and crawl in for a nice long sleep. It's 
not quite eight o'clock, so I didn't make it that late, but I am pretty uh, tired, so I think I should have a good sleep. See you in the morning. Oh, it's uh, nine o'clock. Not too bad of a sleep. Not the best either. Just gonna start packing up and start pulling my sled back to my car. All packed up, ready to go. A couple hundred meters of forest, then I'll be back out to that snow-covered road. Hopefully there is still a lot of snow, uh, so it's not too hard to drag this sled. Just wanted to say thanks for watching, and if I don't see you before Christmas, have a wonderful Christmas and a nice new year, and I'll see you next time. Take care.